to my channel. So you guys, we are finally, finally get to do my February makeup favorites. You guys, I love these videos so much. It's amazing like how I really, you know, talk about all the things I just love for this month. I want to just know I have a lot of products and also in front of me and also stay tuned for my next video. I have all of my empties right here for this month of February so I wish you guys to stay tuned for that. But if you guys are also new to my channel don't forget to hit thumbs up and also guys don't forget to subscribe because are brand new. Also make sure you guys also ring that bell so that way you guys see more awesome content every Monday, Wednesday, and also Friday. I have a lot of new content very soon and also make sure you guys stay tuned for my February if the video so you'll see that really soon also my empties and then i need to get back into my make tutorials so you'll see the rest of my other spring and all that so i wish you guys keep on that but if you guys have any recommendations of make tutorials that you guys want me to do then let me know in the comments down below but further ado, let's just go ahead and get started. All right guys, so the first one I absolutely love, this is the Family Size Gold Bond New Look Seven Moisturizers Three Vitamins. Healing Hydrating Lotion Olay Intimate Hydration that lasts 24 hours for dry to after dry skin. So I really have a new mark and I'm literally right here. So I'm already on my third row right now, but this is gonna take a while, but this will probably be in my next empties, probably in March or April. It really kind of depends like how much makeup I find. I love this lotion and it's also, if you're doing like massages, this is a really good lotion to have. But you guys will see this in my future part of the pan and also my next fair video because I can't wait for you guys to see this in Mantis. Now the next one I absolutely love and you guys will see this deodorant in my empties. This is the Secret Outlast Sweat and Dior Completely Clean Up to 40 Hour Invisible Solid. This is the one I've had in my skincare part of the pan, but I just wanna show you guys this in my first video. I do have the gel one, but that's not gonna be my empties until this one is finished. I'm gonna show you guys a little what it looks like. Ta-da! This is how much of this one I'm literally at right now. It's getting really, really close, and I'm very proud of finishing this deodorant. But this smell, it smells good. I can't wait for you guys to see this next month. Also, this is expired until December 2023 of this year. I'll probably already use this up before it expires. I already used it today, so I'm really glad I'm actually finishing that up. All right, now the next product, you guys, I absolutely love. This is the Nutures Bouncy Hair Skin Nails Gummy. It's convinced up to two times more bison versus our standard HSN gummy. I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. This is my other one that I just show you guys, like it's already open. You already saw the other one, I talked about my empty, but this is the one I was exactly talking about. May of next year, but this will probably expire up being empty sometime in the future. Right now, I'm literally right here. So by the time you guys see this, it will be in my next empty. But this is a really, really good gummies. Plus the smell. Oh my 
gosh, I can't wait to talk about this man piece. It's really good to kind of like shake it up, that way all the product can kind of like le release and stuff. All right, now this is the hand soap I'm already working on right now. And I will definitely buy some more of Beth May Works like really soon. This is the Beth May Works Deep Cleansing Hand Soap with Neutral Seasonal Oil and it's called Island Papaya. Right now, you guys can see I'm really up here right now. My mom finally got this thing out. It's really hard sometimes to get the pump out so you can kind of like use it. But the fragrance notes, it's tropical coconut, fresh papaya, and sugar cane. I forgot what this smells like. Oh my gosh. But if you guys are still want to buy more perfumes of the semi sale, then go and buy some of my works hand soaps because this one is so good and I can wait to try out more. But stay tuned for this in my next empties. All right, guys, this is the mousse I am already working on right now. This is the Herbal Extendians Total Twisted Curl Boosty Mousse. Stretch away for weightless, touchable curls all day with berries, mix, extensions, all day humidity, protection, and first and control. If you guys hear that, this is like literally about maybe two years left. I'm really glad I have a backup, so whenever I get more mousses in my AFC, then you guys know I'm always, always talking about different mousses and other hair products, but this is really, really good. I have talked about this in my past empties, so make sure you guys stay tuned for this in my next empties next month, so stay tuned. All right. Now, the other thing you guys know, I'm already working on my dress shampoo right now. This is the one I got in my Boss Charm a long time ago, but I can't wait to try out more dress shampoos in my Ipsy. This is the Hot Toby Before Irene Deep Protection Mist, the shade of called Dry Bar. I'm gonna go ahead and put this on right now. Plus the smell, it's really good. And I'm so happy that Boss Charm put this in my box, but I definitely wanna try out their shampoos and conditioners and so many other accessories in my collection because this is a really, really good dress shampoo. I want you guys to know I do have one more dress shampoo left, and that is the Bantis one that I got from TJ Maxx, but I will definitely go back to TJ Maxx and get some more dress shampoos because there's so many of them I haven't even tried yet. But this one will be in my next month and these in March. And also my hand soap and other stuff I just talked about. Now this one is my absolute favorite perfume I just love and that is the winter berry wonder and this is from back my works i'm gonna go ahead and put some on right now but man you guys the smell of this is so good it is i was gonna get some more perfumes at the semi sale but i already have I have eight perfumes left in my collection, but don't you guys worry, I will also include more separate small perfumes in my smaller bag, and then the big perfumes and other hand sanitizers will be in my other bag. So you'll see a lot of perfumes and a lot of hand sanitizers in there. All right, guys, now let's go ahead and move on with my makeup. All right, my first favorite is this Neutrogena Ostra Booth Hydro on Acid Ostra Soft Closing Toilets. It's literally finishing up right now. I have heard a lot about these new ones, but I'm so glad I bought a pack of these at Costco. I forgot what they smell like. 
They do have a nice scent, but I'm really excited if you see this in my next makeup empties. I always switch off my products, like whenever I finish a product inside my makeup bag. Right here, I literally put everything in my empties that I finish. And then I just switch off of other products that I really need to go through. But don't worry guys, I'm always gonna be adding more in my empties. All right. Now, this one, you guys, this is the cleansing water I got at TZ Maxx. This is the Clean It Zero cleansing water from Vanilla Co. And I bought it for $7.99, but I love this cleansing water so much. If I do get another cleansing water in my UFC, then you guys know I'll put them in my empties. Right now, you guys know I'm literally down right here. This is so awesome. I can't wait to go to the Max and get another cleansing water that I can find. Plus, I forgot what it smells like. Hmm, not bad. But this will be in my makeup empties. All right, guys. So you guys want to know of this lipstick I'm actually wearing right now. I'm wearing this Betty Boo by FC, and this is the shade called Mevit Baby. And I know you guys wanna know how far I am. See, this is how much I've been working on right now. Whenever you guys, I finish a lipstick, you guys know I'll put in my empties. Or if I actually find them in my drawer, it's always good to put them in your next empties which I did exactly the same thing for two of these. But don't you guys worry that a lot of these are like very old makeup. A lot of them will be in my next upcoming makeup empties. But you guys will see a lot of these in my Ipsy choices and stuff. But once I do finish this Baby Boop by UFC, then I will use this one after. And I always put another one in there just to like have an extra product. I have this CoverGirl At Last Long Wear Moisture, and I have the shade 905. I'm gonna show you guys how far I am. See, I kind of like really kind of figure, I was like, you know, both of these are almost a sack same. See, you guys can see they're both literally the same length but in different colors. So if one finishes, I'll put that in my empties and then I go to this CoverGirl one. And if it does the same thing, then, then I'll grab two more, then I just put those in my bag. And then by that time, you guys, I will have more lipsticks and more lip glosses in my new products, but also having a lot less lipsticks in my collection. But you guys will see both of these in my future empties. But stay tuned for this one in my empties, and also stay tuned for this one in my empties. I do have another one of these, but it's also the red one. And the other one, I'm really excited to see this also in my empties. This is the color Maze Lip Gloss, but also I got this at the Dollar Tree. I'm gonna show you guys of how far I am. And I already put on my lip gloss. If you guys can't really see, I'm literally getting close of putting this in my empties. This is actually finishing up, but I will definitely put this in my empties and I'll put another lip gloss in there. That will be the Always Wear Your Visible Crown called Cotton Candy. This is the other one you will also see in my future empties too. All right, now the other one you guys know I love this mascara so much. And that is the Pure Fully Charged Magnetic Mascara. But this mascara you guys can see has the, there's like not the fat black thingy in there. This is a really nice lightening mascara. I don't think these have a scent. They kind of do, but not too bad. 
The only mascaras I really want to talk about in my empties is the Incense products, which I really, really want to try. And also Heart Candy. So if you guys ever want me to do another Heart Candy mystery box, let me know. I can definitely do it for you guys. But anyway, I'm really glad I'm going through one mascara at a time. No matter how long it takes, it still goes in my empties anyway. Alright, now this is the foundation you guys know I'm right working on right now. And that is the Tarte Shape Tape Me Foundation. And this is the Tarte Double Duty Beauty. But I do have the shade called Light Me and Neutral. But this is still pretty full, but when you guys see this in my empties again, I will still have the stick, but I'm always rotating a lot of my old foundations right now. And I'm always putting them in my empties because I love going through my old stuff. But I can't wait to try out new and old foundations. That's why you guys see a lot of this old stuff in my empties and then I'm always switching off new stuff. But I want you guys to know is that whenever I get new foundations in my Ipsy, then I'm always leaving them inside the packaging, not use them because I'm trying to go through my old stuff first. And then if I ever need foundation, I could just grab that. I can mix my old one and my new one and I can just like, it could just like match my face. Now this one, you guys, I have been using this every single day without a doubt. And that is the Contour Lip Mask. But if you guys wanna know, I got this in my Ipsy a long, long time ago, like three years ago. Bam. So I am really excited for you guys to see this in my empties. But I'm always gonna be adding my, my old chapsticks into my empties. And every time I get new chapsticks or like oils, whatever, it will still stay in my box like whenever I do a chapstick haul. But this is really, really good and I can't wait really to try out more. And that is why I put it right there. So every morning, every night, I just put it on. All right guys, and we have three more products and we are made it finally to the end. Now this one, I can't wait to buy more of this. This is the Hard Candy Translucent Loose Powder. This is the first one I've ever, ever got at Walmart, but this is so awesome, you guys. I wanna show you guys the inside. See, that is where I'm at right now on the inside. Whenever you guys have a little bit of time left, I put it into my other powders that I'm actually gonna be using next. That will be this e.l.f. Soft Illuminous Powder next. But I'm definitely gonna put these two in my makeup bag. Every time you guys know, when I do my makeup hauls, you guys know, Every time I get any makeup powders, it just leaves inside this of my care drawer. All right, now the last two products I can't wait to show you guys. This is my other favorite bronzer I can't wait to talk about. That is the Too Faced Milk Chocolate Sololi Longwear Me Bronzer. See, you guys know I'm really proud. I'm scraping every bit of this bronzer. I'm very proud of finishing and getting rid of a lot of my old stuff so I can have new products into my collection. But this one is not empty yet, but this smells really, really good. All right, guys, the last product I have is this Too Faced Papa Dome Peach. You guys, I am so proud of myself. But this smell, oh my gosh. I can't wait to try out the foundation, their sun spray, their concealer, a lot of their stuff. But this one will definitely be in my future makeup and these. All right guys, so that is literally everything in my makeup favorites. 
everything you guys are talking about, it goes right into this bag. That is literally a lot of makeup that I just use. You guys will see a lot more makeup, empties, and all that stuff. But also guys, stay tuned for my next video, it's my empties, and then this is the last time you guys are going to see this, and then you'll see more products in March and April. So I'm really glad I'm always throwing everything away in the recycling, and you guys will see a ton more in the future, because I'm really, really proud and trying out new things I've had in my collection for a really long time that I really need to go through. But if you guys really enjoy these type of videos, do actually hit a thumbs up. And also guys, don't forget to subscribe. It's brand new. And also make sure you guys also ring that bell and let me know what other videos you'd love to see in my upcoming hair care, skincare, makeup type of hauls and also I have my accessory haul and I also have my skincare right there so we'll see a lot of that stuff in the future but I love you guys all so much and I'll see you guys in my next video bye